essentially the building features very simple improvements you know, but significant in the sense that the building can now be used as a hurricane shelter um, and we've enhanced the security of the building and in, in conjunction with all that you know if, if you notice there's no electricity lines bringing power to the area so in the, with the inclusion of a solar powered system the building can now function off grid to power um, pumps for running water for cleaning, um, fans for cooling, lights, you know, to be able to to, to, to function in, in building and also to to run, you know, other stuff like refrigerators and computers necessary for the, the improved uh, maintenance of records and such for the cooperative. This is an area that is, that is producing a whole lot of fruits and vegetables, um, providing food for not only Belize City, but we say the entire Belize district, the San Pedro, Kikaka area. Not too long ago, we conducted a social and economic impact assessment of what just the road have done for, um, for, for this area. And when you look, for example, um, at the nearby villages here, they are starting to see more inflow of vehicles coming for fruits and vegetables and thereafter they would stop there and buy lunch, eh, food and at the same time there is more money that is circulating in this area which means that there is an increase of consumption from the nearby stores, uh, grocery shops um, and any other thing that, any other item that you can consume around here. I'm always thankful. I appreciate the work of um, GOB and RRB in this area. I'm always thankful. You know, I remember days coming back here when the first time I made an attempt to come to Nago Bank, I turned back. I didn't make it here. So it's wonderful to see the vast improvement on the roads. 